Welcome, and welcome back to all that the wind has brought here, to another episode of Roots of Pacha, where it is the second of spring. And it's time for us to start working on some stuff. We do need to finish planting our field um, and making some more pickles. Oh, dear God, we need to make more pickles. But we were, we are working our way through that. We'll say hi to Shadow this morning. And we'll go and we'll check on the animals. We're going to work on cleaning this up before it becomes completely overgrown. Um, grab an egg. We will grab some wool because we have some bison with fuzzy bums. We'll come in here. We are going to keep whistling the chickens. And talking to the chickens. They're getting there. They're almost ready to breed, actually. And we'll whistle to the baby. Because that's important. And we'll talk to the baby and we'll milk this ibex. The other one won't be ready until tomorrow. And we'll share that boar as well. Or bison as well. That's that's not a boar, you guys. That's a bison. <laughs> it's fine. I knew that. It's all good. Okay. So, things for us to work on today. I'm going to try and get some more of these pickles going. We're going to pickle another egg. Because pickled eggs are good. We're going to grab out our vinegar, and we're just going to get that going. Pickle those. And then, we're going to grab out uh, the sweet here, and then we'll be almost done with this. Okay. That's going well. Now I do want to take another quick glance here. Oh, this actually stayed this time around. That's awesome. Um, Garrick's idea. We still need a little bit more clan prosperity. Um, and then we need to get him some hardwood, some stone, copper, and tin. Ron's idea, though, we just need some cheese and some wine. Um, and we'll be able to do that. So hopefully soon, we're going to put away some of these materials here. I'm going to pull that out. We're going to pull that out. We can actually start selling this fur now, which will be great. Because I think we're going to have a massive tree farm underneath our current field is my plan here. So if we look at the map, we've got this giant field that we've done, and all of this I think we're going to make into trees. This will be good for trees. So we'll start doing that. We may edge this up nicely with some pathing. We'll see. Maybe not, though. But we are going to get a whole bunch of trees going. Oh yeah, and I need to put away this wood. And that's everything there. We'll throw the rest of that fiber into um, into our fiber storage for the animals. We'll get this pump going here. And we just have a little bit more crops to plant, so we'll grab something out of, out of Grandpa's uh, stock and get that taken care of. Zelk is here, so we'll take a look and see if there's anything we want to buy from him. Look at that pickled beet, 253. 253, you guys. That's awesome. I met Akka's wolves before I met her. I thought I was done for. 
That is, until a little girl, only a couple of springs younger than me, scolded them. That's cute. Okay, lavender, some beer. We don't need any of that. We don't need any of that. Yeah, we don't need any of this, so that's fine. Yeah. Okay. So, what do we need? Well, we need our grandpa. For starters. Grandpa! Plants in the field need water to grow. Thank you, Grandpa. It's very important knowledge, you know. They need, they need water to grow. I know, shocker, right? Let's buy some more quinoa. We're gonna need it. Let's buy some more wheat. We're gonna need that. And we'll see if we need anything else. Just yet. You guys can stick with me while we do one more cycle of planting here. Because I don't want to, you know, completely ignore the farming part of the farming game. But I promise all the harvesting and stuff, I won't make you sit through all of it. Don't you worry. But some of the basic stuff, we can go ahead and do together. Um, let's get some more wheat in the ground here. Okay, and... Coming back to page one, let's get some more quinoa on the ground. And uh, this is not going to be enough. <laughs> we do not have enough crops here. So let's see what else we can get from Grandpa. Maybe some of that uh, sea kale that we need. Plants in the field need water to grow, and I think they like the attention. This is also true. That is fair. Okay. Let's see. Actually, let's get these. Let's get these. Let's get like 50 of those. And that should do us. At least for now, that should do us. So, let's get all this garlic in. Okay, not Sage, you can go over there. Because you are being very unhelpful at the moment. And then, potatoes. And then, kale. Which, kale grows pretty quick. Not a big deal. Okay, that's that. So now that the whole field is planted, let's take a look at maybe getting some Hmm, I'm thinking we might start with pomegranates, but let's see what we need. I don't see us getting plant knowledge about pomegranates. Hmm. Oh no, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Almonds, avocados, coconuts, dates. We're at rank one of all of these. So let's plant some pomegranates. I think that would be useful to us. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. And we're out of money. But that's fine. So... Here's what I'm thinking, right? These are our pomegranate saplings here. So we plant one, maybe under, excuse me, excuse me again. Oh my gosh. We plant one, maybe like 
this. Yeah, that works, right? Let's get this tree out of the way. This is in our way. Okay. Now that that's out of the way. So we'll do something like that. I think this whole row will make pomegranates eventually. And then beneath that, we'll put the pines. Those are going to need to start like this. Okay. That's doable. Let's get some of this chopped up. I want to be careful that I don't accidentally chop that, I think. Okay. I like how this is coming along. Then we'll go ahead and once we've taken care of this, what we're going to do next is we're going to go out into the woods and we're going to try and find that Ibex that we're still looking for still looking for and allow me to reiterate once more still looking for the ibex but hopefully we will find it soon okay so We'll do something like this. And that's looking pretty good, you guys. We have a nice little field of trees. Over by our nice little farm plot there. It's going to be great. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. As soon as it's dealt with. And it's, it's not quite there yet. But it will be soon. So. Let's get some more vinegar going. And let's get some more beer going. All right, we'll get some more beets in. All right. And this is coming along nicely. Let's go ahead and toss in some pickles. And that'll be that. And then let's run off to the woods. Well, after we speak to Bella. Because we're still working towards them. But now we know that Zeta needs peppers. It's always nice when we run into each other. This is true. Let's dance. Okay. Let's see here. We do have copper for acre. We have strawberries. We have sunflowers. Um, it's not Jag's birthday just yet. This is great. The best things are the most useful ones. Right Jalrod's yeah. so much like his dad when he was younger. He cares too much about what others think. Yeah, That's fair. Do, uh, Let's dance. <laughs> Work hard, play hard. Okay. Don't worry, we will get to the others like Aloe and all them and yeah, Vor and and Croc and Zeta. But for right now, let's go 
and try and find that ibex, hopefully. Ah, still no white ibex. Okay. That's okay. And I don't think we have any pomegranates just yet. And I don't think we even have any pine cones just yet. We're gonna have to wait on these things. Well, we'll talk to Brub. Inz and I like to take it easy. It's how life is meant to be lived. That's fair. We'll stance. Excuse me, I am uh, experiencing allergies. Something awful, let me tell you what. Do we have any boars or is Lil up here? That'd be the other thing we're looking out for. That's a brown boar. We found those. Man. Lil is not up here either. Oh well. Well, that's okay for the moment. No pomegranates just yet, but we will get there. We'll get something to juice. And then we'll get something to turn into wine. And it'll be great. Then we'll start working on things with Ron. And we're getting close on the Clan Prosperity to work on things with Garrick. And, and hopefully we'll be able to significantly increase the output of this area here once we have done that. Um, we need more grain. We are out of grain. That is not great. Um, we could do corn. Tempting. Tempting to do corn. But I'm sure we have something better. Just wheat. Hmm. Well, let's grab out the wheat that we have. And all the wheat that we have, indeed. Let's grab it all. And just get it processing. Because the faster we process through this stuff, the better. Okay. We have plenty of fermented grains at this point. Which is just fabulous. Um, see, there's, there's some more oats. So that's fine. Uh, we can sell these. We've almost made it through those beets. And then we'll start doing these cabbages. And that'll be great. And then we're going to go through all of the top quality stuff first. But we'll work through all of that. That's not something I'm so worried about, you know? And then... Got a little vinegar here. Get some pickles going. This is great. This is going to be fantastic. We're going to throw those in. That brings us up to 114 again. That whole area is going to be for processing eventually. And then... Let's get some of these rocks smashed up. Because I want to grow a ton of fiber in this area. That's the goal. I want our fiber to grow so our animals are happy. That's the goal here. Okay. This is great, though. I mean, yeah, we've got corn and things to worry about, but we'll get there. We're gonna get so much done. This is so awesome. Just a little bit more beets and then we'll get it all taken care of. But just this, just this whole field is just incredible. Now for crafting beehives, wood and plant fiber, like that's, that's nothing. 
Let's go put down a whole bunch of beehives. Let's let's get our beehives going. Let's get some wood. Let's get some fiber. And let's just craft like all the beehives. Eh, it's four. That's fine. We need more wood, but that's also fine. Um, yeah, that'll be great. Let's get four more beehives in. Now what I'd like to do, honestly, let's get these up over here. And we'll get more down the edge. But that's just going to be straight up massive amounts of meat once it's done. Which is just going to be fantastic. <laughs> Let's see if anything's finished before we run off to bed. See? Look how much finished. Oh, this is great. Let's get those fermenters back on the go. All right. And then we can go to bed. And that's going to be awesome. I know these are slightly longer episodes than normal because we've just been going through the day getting the fields planted and things. But we're up to 281,000 clan prosperity. The clan's going to finish the stage tomorrow. And we are up another 2384. So we may be able to get some more trees on the go. Go ahead and give that a save. It's going to bring us up to 2405. And we will awaken to a completed stage. Next time we will have another pyramid sculpture to place. And Jag's birthday is coming up tomorrow. So that is excellent. Dari and Jalrod, I'm reading this out to you guys just in case it gets deleted. Made the perfect place to dance and perform. They decided to call it a stage. And we're going to have to check that out as well. But these things are going to have to wait. For with the singing of the game and the ending of the day, we have come to the end of the episode. If you guys like what you see, please feel free to hit that thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more, consider subscribing. But until next time, may the wind bring you on another journey. And have a good night.